Hey everyone, every forum I'm on, everyone's always asking, why should I jailbreak? So, I figured, okay, maybe what I'll do is, I will um, videotape my phone, which is jailbroken, iPhone 4, and show you the cool things that you can do with your phone when it's jailbroken. Okay, so now we have my home screen which you can see is very different from any other phone so we'll go ahead and we'll unlock it and so you get to my home screen which is a little bright but you can see that the um, folders are clear which allows you to see right through to the background it's a lot easier and if I open up one of my folders you'll see the background is very different than what you usually get and you'll see all the icons are also um, very different um, you can um, if you're a jailbreaker you'll know that you can add themes um, but mine is even more customized because um, the icons uh, some of them you'll find in some themes but a lot of them I actually customized it myself um, so they're actually, you will only find them on my phone. Um, so next, I'll show you another cool thing you can do. So, let's say you saw my um, lock screen and the image. Um, but let's say I get bored. So I go into iFile. And I've created a whole bunch of um, different uh, wallpapers. And in iFile, I can go through them and uh, I can pick a different one okay this one's pretty cool so let me go ahead uh, that was um, background 4 I'll go ahead and put that one on so what I gotta do is I gotta go down you'll see I have a whole bunch of different backgrounds um, so I gotta go down to the one that's on currently and rename that uh, and I think that one is 13. No, it's not. Okay. Uh, that one is 9. So we'll rename that one 9. And then we will rename 4. Yep, that's the one we want. We'll rename that one just background dot ping and then you can get out and you can respring and once it resprings There you go. For some reason it always comes up with this garbled um, graphic for a while and then there you can there you go. You see my new uh, my new background there. Uh, so I can cycle through uh, all of the the different ones. I have 21 of them right now. So um, I can change it whenever I want. Um, my dock, you'll notice nowhere on my screen do you see the, the new newsstand app. Um, well, that's because I have InfiniDock. So if I scroll, you'll see there's the newsstand. So I can scroll back and forth on my dock to all the different stuff that, um, that I want to use. Um, another cool thing with Jailbreak. Um, now another cool thing is the sounds. Uh, when I unlocked it, you heard a sound. Now if I go into the messages, and I will message my wife and ask her to send me um, a test text. Oh. And uh, when I send it... There we go. Now if I get out, 
and hopefully she'll send me a text back. Uh, I'll also ask a friend of mine, uh, just in case she's busy, just in case. She so. Alright, there we go, we'll see if uh, he replies back, and I can change that tone that plays when you send the text, I've had a gunshot, uh, sound of a turbo spooling up, all sorts of different things, um, and hopefully if someone ever sends me a text, then um, we'll see what else I can do here. Uh, with the sounds. Um, I'll show you also uh, Byte SMS. Um, looks like no one's sending me a text. Come on people, where you at? Now if I zoom in on my carrier, you'll also see if it stops being blurry that it says, well, you, you can't really see because it keeps, um, it actually says Skynet. Um, so that's something else you can do. You can change the carrier to say whatever it is you want it to say. Um, and again, if I uh, go to the app switcher um, to kill an app, you see that it has that... Um, that same background. New text message. There we go. Okay, so that's what it sounds like when I receive a text message. Now, if I actually get one when I'm in the texting app, it sounds a lot different. Let's see if he'll send it. And if he replies soon enough. You have new text message. So there you go, just a few of the cool things that you can do. Now if I open Safari also, um, let me see now, uh, if I open a new page on a regular iPhone you'll get a blank page. On my phone it opens Yahoo. Um, that's because I have a Safari home page in Jailbreak, so that's another cool tweak that I really love. Um, it's really cool not to get a blank page and have to type it, especially if you use the same uh, page all the time to do searches, that kind of stuff. So yeah, there you have it. A lot of cool stuff you can do. Um, stay tuned. I'm going to write up a couple posts about how you can do some of these things. So uh, if you thought it was cool and you'd love to do that to your phone, you're jailbroken. Stay tuned.